Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Spartan 3 Crusher here again with another tabletop review. Um, right now I'm mixing it up with a tabletop light review, not a knife, but a flashlight. But um, before we get started, I want to give a quick shout out to the people who made this possible. The new store that opened up near where I live called Overwatch Supply. Um, awesome store, awesome stuff. Uh, they had... Um, a bunch of 5.11 flashlights and fortunately for me they had one uh, which the fit the criteria which the I've been looking for was a pin light that took AAA batteries so shout out to them for making this all possible and, uh, I would have never even I, I probably would have never even gotten a flashlight if they never would have been here I was looking at stuff totally different from this flashlight here because I, I couldn't find the one that I really wanted. But um, shout out to them, Overwatch Supply. Look them up on Facebook, look them up online, like them on Facebook. They're really awesome. Got a bunch of cool stuff, really friendly people, great prices. So back to the review though. Uh, this is a 511 a TMT PLX. A little pin light, which is very awesome. It's a um, all, I, I don't know if this is aluminum or stainless either way whatever this is is a very light type of metal but um it's very durable I mean this isn't going anywhere but uh it takes triple A's two of them so it was really cool before I forget is this came in the package uh, in the package it comes with Duracells a really high quality really nice um, battery but a uh, very awesome little pin light very bright too, 90 lumens. That's bright. Go ahead and uh, turn off the light here. So you see how dark it is, but uh, turn on this light. And it just brightens up the whole little cupboard I'm in right here. Turn the light back on. But uh, back to the review here. Um, I mean, it's a nice little, it's a nice little 20, $26 uh, flashlight. Uh, it's, it's very it's, it's very hefty not heavy but it, it feels it feels durable and I like that you know I don't want it I don't want a, a light that's really you know, plasticky or cheap feeling and this is this doesn't feel cheap whatsoever this is really nice and um, I'm glad it's great buy 26 bucks I like it but um it's very basic just one just one function you know on and then uh, off but uh the cool thing about this button here it has a long uh, press so if you know you don't want to turn it on you can hold it like this or if you want to do a quick flash you could uh, just quickly press it and um so that so that's what's awesome with this uh, long press button so it, you know you could do a lot more things with it and not actually have a dedicated function for it you know i like that which is really nice but um it only has a one output, which is you know max output, 90 lumens. So there's no uh, dimmer output, which is, I, d I don't really care about that. Um, you know, I just wanted a very basic light. I, didn't, I don't want a bunch of functions and features, and I just want you know I just want to be able to turn it on and turn it off. That's all I care about. But um, very nice switch, very tactile feeling. You know, good response on this button here. Uh, loud click you know as you can hear it very nice click but um this is what comes with it in the box it comes with a little bit package uh very basic manual tells you the do's and do nots and a uh, limited lifetime warranty all that stuff so very nice i highly doubt you're gonna have to send this in for warranty i don't know why you would have to send this in a warranty i mean unless it like blew up or something and I don't ever see this thing breaking because this is just very durable but um very nice very nice pocket clip um kind of a deep carry and let's see kind of a deep carry kind of zoom in there yeah it's kind of a deep carry but you know it, it's a flashlight you know deep carry pocket clips doesn't really matter on a flashlight you know you're not trying to hide this from somebody nobody cares if you have a flashlight I mean people will care if you're carrying a knife that's why I recommend deep carry pocket clips on all knives, but flashlights, it doesn't matter. Um, what I would like to see, though, is 
something different with this flashlight is the way that the clip is attached. Um, it's, as you can see, it's, it's attached by the, you know, it, it hugs, I guess, this, um, the flashlight. It doesn't screw into the flashlight. And, you know, that's not a big deal. But, you know, if, let's say you did want to upgrade, um, you, you wouldn't be able to unscrew it, but, uh, you know, and this may be able to pull off. I don't know. I mean, me just tugging on it, it's not coming off, but I, I, I do like screws better than this, but that doesn't matter. That's, you know, that's all opinion kind of stuff. It, it doesn't, it doesn't, you know, do anything with function. It doesn't have any bad consequences with the function, but, um, very nice light. Uh, I really recommend this light. Honestly, it's it's such a good little pin light. Um, to be honest, I think I'm gonna come Christmas time. I think I'm gonna buy a bulk of these and uh, give them to my, give them to uh, you know people in my family because I mean it's such a good little light. It's awesome, you know. It's durable. It's cheap. Twenty six bucks for this is cheap. It's an awesome price. Um, you know, it's hefty. It's got a good weight to it. And uh, it's strong, all metal, and um, I don't ever see this thing breaking, and I, I see this lasting a long time. So, I, I really recommend it, giving this to, you know, uh, some family members. You know, you could throw this in your car, in a glove compartment, in a, in a cupboard or something. You have a few of these in the house in case, you know, power goes out. I mean, this is awesome for lighting up a room. I mean, it just shines up the entire room. It's, it is amazing how much light this little bitty pin light uh, puts out um i drove down a dark road and i pulled off to the side of the road and um i mean it's pitch black dark outside and you know i kind of live out and you know, there's some places where you can go it's very wooded and i took this thing out the car and i shined it and it just su supposedly it shines for like i think 40 feet or something but i mean it just i mean it was like night and day it, it was so bright. I mean, you could see every little detail of the woods. I mean, it was awesome. So this thing is very bright, and it shines a lot of light. And um, it's not, f it's not focused. You know how you know it's like a beam. It kind of um, as you can see here. Here's the you know here's the here's the beam part, but then it has the halo, so it kind of fills up the whole room with light, and not just one little part, which yeah, I like. You know, this is more of a lighting up a room and not really blinding somebody or, you know, doing something. It's not a tactical light. Uh, you know, let's, like, let's say if you're holding a pistol, you know, you're not going to be using this for a pistol. I mean, you can, but, you know, I recommend more lumens and more of a dedicated beam instead of kind of that room of halo effect. So, I really like this light. Um... I carried it. The, I carried it as soon as I got it, and it fits perfectly with my EDC. You know, I put it in the same pocket with my Griptilian. Very nice. It um doesn't bother. It's not the weight doesn't weigh me down or nothing. So it's very awesome. Very light. Um, the weight, if I had to guess, would be around three, four ounces. Somewhere, somewhere around there. The the weight of my Griptilian, which is not bad. You know. It's, it, the batteries is the only thing that pretty much weighs it down. If, if I didn't have the batteries in here, it, it's pretty much a feather. I mean, that's how light this thing is. It's so amazing how light this is. But um, I really like this. 511 really have a, has a great product right here. And um, I'm, I'm actually surprised. You know, I was looking at the Olight uh, S2 baton. And, you know, it's a, it's a little bit, it's a, a lot thicker. Um, I think it's like a... Oh, God, I, I can't remember how many lumens. It's a lot more lumens than this. Um, but it doesn't take triple A's or double A's or nothing. It takes its own specific lithium-ion battery, which, the, I mean, that's cool and all. But, you know, let's say, you know, something bad happens to the battery. For some odd reason, the battery goes kaput or, or something. You can't just go to Walmart or, you know, the nearest dollar store and get a get an Olight battery. But with this, you know, it's triple A's. Everybody has triple A's in their house, so, you know. That's why, that's why I really wanted something that if the batteries go dead or something, it, I don't have to worry about recharging or nothing. I could just switch them out with new ones. So, very nice. Very reliable. And um, I don't know if this is waterproof or not, but uh, I wouldn't test it, though. But uh, very nice light. I really recommend it. You know, go out and buy one as soon as you can. Uh, they're awesome. You know, 26 bucks. you can't get a better deal. So, 
But either way, guys, uh, I'm going to be doing a lot more um, product reviews. Uh, I'm trying to you know be be cool with the uh, people down at Overwatch Supply. They're really nice. I um, I might be uh, borrowing some of their products to do reviews on. Um, they have some cool knives there. I might be doing some reviews on maybe. Ho hopefully, if if all goes well, I'm, I'm going to do a review on the K Bar Dozier. You know some other cool things. It, it's all up in the air right now. I might talk about them, talk to it about them, and uh, so keep keep in touch for that. But um, you know, cross our fingers. Let's hope that all goes well. But like I said, they're cool people. Check out their website. You know, check they're they're on Facebook, Overwatch Supply. Um, like their page. They're awesome people. Very friendly. Good prices. Good products. But um, either way, guys, I'm Spart Three Crusher, and uh, I'm signing out.